So for, for a black kid growing up on the block today, do you think it's better or worse? Well, it hasn't really changed much. Uh, the houses are about the same. Uh, there used to be houses down further on the corner. I don't know what's happened down there where it's all fenced in now, but it really hasn't changed much. I think that's probably the biggest problem is that there hasn't been any change. Mm. It's been pretty much stagnant for quite some time. Um, you know, and, and that's one of the things that I think is, uh, uh, is difficult for people to tolerate is that they see change happening in other places, but not much happening in their own communities. You know, Prospect was the center of our economic activity, and even then it wasn't very much, and I don't think it's changed in the least bit now. But the economics are such that it's not providing a ton of jobs, it's not providing a lot of tax income that you could use in order to improve the neighborhoods through CIDs. Uh, and racial issues now are just as much about economics as it is about race. Mm -hmm. And the economics have not changed. Still high unemployment, um, still lacking in certain infrastructure needs, and um, uh, mm. it just doesn't seem to be getting better. And that's something that we absolutely have to address. And you And the infrastructure need the, the streetcar expansion, that was going to be trying to address it, because it was going to, it, was it going to come all the way over to Prospect, the streetcar expansion? It would have, but it would have been on Limwood, on, okay. uh, down, uh, a little further north, uh -huh. and that was one of the ideas was that by bringing the streetcar east, we would have brought some of the transit-oriented development that actually comes with it, and it was a perfect opportunity to do something and leverage that money and have it work for the east side of town, and it's, I'm still sorry about the way that that turned out. Me too. Yeah, it really would Me have too, been yeah. helpful. Really would have been helpful. Do you, so when I was talking with some people about it, um, they, they mentioned it as it, unfortunately, being uh, an issue of race, that they were concerned that it might bring people from the east side into downtown. What, what are you, what can we do about that? Well, they can, they can do that now on buses. Right. I mean, that's an unfortunate thing, and I, and I did hear that. And I heard that when we were talking with folks out in Brookside, somebody said something like that. And I said, you don't think they, that people from the east side can get here now? I mean, you were just, they were touting the bus uh, 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 as a mode of transportation. You don't think people ride the bus now? And right. besides that, what do you expect to have happen? Somebody's gonna break into your house, steal your television, and then wait for the streetcar? <laughs> you know, I mean, seriously. Yeah. But that's, that's, that's racism. That's, that's a racist concept. <laughs>